Hello. So I have my Astral B minor tongue drum here and I wanted to share a few things that you can think about um, with positioning your tongue drum when you're getting ready to start playing. Okay, so when you are getting ready to play your tongue drum, um, one thing that you wanna think about is which notes are helpful to be on which sides of your hands. And typically when I'm playing, um, especially if the notes don't matter, like if you're not trying to hit a specific note and you're just kind of doing different patterns or rhythms, um, what I like to do is focus on what hand I'm going to be dominantly playing. So I'm right-handed, so I really like um, for the larger notes, um, the lower notes or the larger tongues, um, to be closer to where my right hand's going to be hitting a lot. So I typically really like for at least one of the larger notes to be here. So you could, you know, rotate your tongue drum and have the smaller notes um, on either side, but I really like um, for my larger notes to be easier to play because I have more control um, in this area. And the reason I like my larger note here is because a lot of times I'm doing a pulse rhythm where I'm keeping the beat steady. So for example, like this. right here on this larger note. Um, so that's one technique to think about. Um, and that's just because I really like my right hand here. But if you um, rotate your tongue drum, which is totally fine to do, um, you will notice that, you know, this is the note that is going to be in my like really easy area of playing. So um, I want you to start thinking about opportunities to rotate your tongue drum. A lot of times there's a design um, where it makes you think that you need to play with the design facing a certain way, um, which is nice, you know, but you can actually rotate your drum um, in a complete circle or play what would look like upside down um, and you can get different sounds this way. So... your tongue drum with a specific position. What I really would think about is just placing it where it's going to be easiest for you to move around depending on what notes you're finding yourself hitting um, that often. So for me, like I said, I really love leading and keeping a pulse note with my right hand. So I will usually pick one of these lower notes and place it right in this direction. Obviously, if you like playing a little higher or lower, closer to you, you can position that note um, either further up or down closer to you, so. Like that. So give it a try, start rotating and just see what comes naturally. All right, thanks so much. Hope you enjoyed these tips and let me know if you have any questions.